BBC investigators fully believed Amanda Abington strictly claims despite actress disappointment in pro-BBC investigators probing complaints made by Amanda Abington previously told the actress they fully believed her claims. Corporation chiefs have conducted two separate interviews with the ex-Sherlock actress. In them she made allegations about sexual, mental and physical misconduct during her time as Giovanni Pernice's dance partner, the Italian, who has quit the show, denies all the allegations against him and is now reportedly planning his own legal claim for compensation due to loss of earnings. As the corporation prepares to release a long-awaited report into the investigation, a BBC insider has revealed. During her first interview with Amanda, the investigators told her, and reassured her, that they fully believed her account of events. Amanda was greatly reassured by this. Despite the stress and strain that bringing these complaints has had, she has no regrets about speaking out. Our story comes in the wake of a report that Amanda was furious that the impending verdict in the Strictly probe was unlikely to go her way, according to The Sun, a source said, she's deeply disappointed with the BBC. She thinks it feels like such a boys club. As well as the probe taking so long, it feels like they are protecting Giovanni to save themselves and ignoring not only her experience but that of other women who've bravely come forward. Amanda feels tired, upset and very angry with the way it's all been handled. She is worried there will be a predictable whitewash and others will, once again, suffer from aggression and abuse. A spokesman for Amanda declined to comment when contacted by GB News. Meanwhile Pernis, who has now left the BBC series, has now announced he will be joining Belando con Lostel, Italy's version of Strictly, when it returns next week. BBC investigators probing complaints made by Amanda Abington previously told the actress they fully believed her claims. Corporation chiefs have conducted two separate interviews with the ex-Sherlock actress. In them she made allegations about sexual, mental and physical misconduct during her time as Giovanni Pernice's dance partner. Recommended by Watt is Outbrain. You have photographic memory if you can name 13 thirtieths of these actors sponsored. You have photographic memory if you can name 13 thirtieths of these actors. Explored Planet. A woman is selling her ex-boyfriend's ring. The jeweler tells her this, sponsored. A woman is selling her ex-boyfriend's ring. The jeweler tells her this. HTTPS colon slash slash bozoba.com. The Italian, who has quit the show, denies all the allegations against him and is now reportedly planning his own legal claim for compensation due to loss of earnings. As the corporation prepares to release a long-awaited report into the investigation, a BBC insider has revealed, during her first interview with Amanda, the investigators told her, and reassured her, that they fully believed her account of events. Amanda was greatly reassured by this. Despite the stress and strain that bringing these complaints has had, she has no regrets about speaking out. Our story comes in the wake of a report that Amanda was furious that the impending verdict in the Strictly probe was unlikely to go her way. Giovanni Pernis The BBC launched a probe into Strictly Come Dancing over Amanda Abington's claims PA. According to The Sun, a source said, She's deeply disappointed with the BBC. She thinks it feels like such a boys' club. As well as the probe taking so long, it feels like they are protecting Giovanni to save themselves and ignoring not only her experience but that of other women who've bravely come forward. Amanda feels tired, upset and very angry with the way it's all been handled. She is worried there will be a predictable whitewash and others will, once again, suffer from aggression and abuse. A spokesman for Amanda declined to comment when contacted by GB News. Meanwhile Pernis, who has now left the BBC series, has now announced he will be joining Belando con Lostel, Italy's version of Strictly, when it returns next week. Amanda Abington Amanda Abington dropped out of last year's Strictly after five weeks PA. Don't miss. Neil Oliver Opinion the West is made being made to forget who they are and it is no accident. Protesters cause chaos on opening day of trade union conference news. Protesters cause chaos on opening day of trade union conference. 
Matt Wallace issues apology in emotional interview after winning European Masters Golf. Matt Wallace issues apology in emotional interview after winning European Masters. In view of his 1.1 million Instagram followers, the choreographer later confirmed the news himself as he gleefully shared the update from Italy. However, he made no mention of the BBC series he had starred in since 2015, instead referring to Bolando Cohn Lustel as Italy's answer to Dancing with the Stars, the US version of the show which debuted a year after Strictly first hit screens in 2004. I'm here to give you some exciting news, because I can finally reveal that from next week, I will be joining the cast of Bolando Cohn Lustel, which is the equivalent of Dancing with the Stars, the Italian version, he explained to social media followers. Of course, I'm excited because finally, I'm back on the dance floor and hopefully I will create some new magic on the dance floor. So I'm very, very very happy. He went on to make the announcement in Italian to cater for audiences from his home country and viewers of Bolando Con Lo earlier on Saturday, an insider told the Mail on Sunday, Gio is thrilled, he has been hoping that it would happen, he had everything crossed. He is so excited that he can keep on dancing and what makes it all the more lovely is that it will be in his home country. The deadline has been looming and the BBC has been on pause with its result but the Bolando bosses love him, they adore him, and they have now signed him. It is absolutely horrendous for Gio. He has been stuck in limbo and has been unable to move on with his life. It will be a lovely, 